other than the fact that we're taking less men, so we're going to invite less women because there's not as many men. Patrick says, how many guys do come on an average tour? Do you expect there to be less ladies showing up to the socials due to COVID? Well, it depends on what tour you're talking about. So if you take average, it's gonna be somewhere around 20, 25 guys, somewhere in that neighborhood, but you could have more, you could have less. It just really depends on the time of year and all that. As far as the ladies, um, I don't expect that we're going to see um, less women showing up other than the fact that we're taking less men. So we're going to invite less women because there's not as many men because we don't want the groups that we had last February. We had, you know, 470 women attending. Um, we just can't do that and stay within the confines and the parameters of what the rules and regulations. complaining about it. Maybe now it will be better. They will like it. They yeah, like we'll see. A few girls yeah. for each guy, so they probably... Yeah, I mean, the ratios are still going to be really good, and you're still going to have a lot of different women there, but um, it's not going to be as crazy as it was there. And you're right, you know, some of the guys were hiding yeah, in the bathroom. Hiding I mean, in the bathroom. they were a little overwhelmed at the pure number of possible candidates that were there. Um, now, by the second social, they got a little more used to it, they were a veteran. Oh, I know what I'm doing. Yeah, you know, and so they were a little more used to it. Um, but that first one, if, if it's your first social and it's a large social like that, it can be overwhelming. Larry says, my hot list has over 50 women. Question, how can I determine which women might meet me so I can refine my list before I go on a tour? Take out all the women that you have more than a 30 year age difference with, first of all, <laughs> then we'll get in closer. Oh, I don't know, you, what, what do you think? I mean, how, yeah, how can you refine that? You have to like uh, select them by age at least. First. You start with the you know, age. If you have some really pronounced age differences, maybe put those off to the side for now and we try We wouldn't recommend more than 20 years. We really don't. So try to keep it to at least 20 years or, or younger, or 20 years or less is what I'm trying to say there. Um, then look at geography, I don't know, 50 miles away or 100 miles away. Let's take those off for now, right? And just try to focus just on the women in that city. So that might get your list down a little bit more. Maybe, maybe you can focus a little bit more on women who speak a little bit better English. Um, all these different things that you can narrow down a little bit. Men from all over the world as they take a trip and find their future brides. Interested? Learn more at peru-women.com. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Then click on the notice bell to get notified every time we add something new.